Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying three new to us items, but they're completely, completely random. Uh, this is the Angie's Boom Chicka Pop Salted Maple Flavored Kettle Corn. This is the Clancy's, which is an Aldi brand, Kettle Braised Beef Short Ribs Kettle Chips. Sounds good, and these are the uh, Doritos uh, Dynamita Flaming Hot Queso. And they're those little sticks like things. We're gonna get rid of prices right now because we've got them on a little piece of paper. Uh, the Doritos were $1.99 at Speedway. The uh, Clancy's were $1.89 at Aldi. And the Angie's Boom Chicken Puff were $2.30 at Target. And when I bought them for $2.30 at Target, it had a clearance sticker on them. So that I got them on sale. And I told Kevin when I bought them, I said, well, this is why they're on clearance because they were hidden. We never saw them to begin with. They were they were on an end cap in the back of the store or on the side of the store. And it's like, well, I've never saw them. No wonder people didn't buy them. Uh, so we're gonna try these first. Uh, no high fructose corn syrup, vegan, kosher, whole grain, gluten-free. There's five servings in the bag. Two and a third cups is 160 calories. It's only 70 calories per cup. Um, That's pretty good. So, yeah, and this is salted maple. Uh, flavored kettle corn with other natural flavors. And I'm gonna use scissors. What I like about uh, Angie's is usually for a serving for me, I just half the bag. I eat half the bag in one setting, half the bag in another setting. Yeah, popcorn's easy to eat. Yes, it is. Bag, it's sure. very easy to eat half the bag. Very strong maple. Mm. Yeah, very sweet. Mm. That's delicious. I could definitely eat half a bag of that. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, easily. You know it's maple. Mm. It's good. And I'm surprised they put this on clearance, and I'm surprised that they didn't bring it out for the fall. I know, this is almost like a fall flavor. Yeah, it just seems like, yeah, it, this is the perfect time, and this is still good. This is still, this bag's still good until November 3rd. So, I mean, there was no reason to put it on clearance. This has had a bunch of it. It, it does it taste like maple. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah, it has a maple flavor. It tastes like you dip popcorn in maple syrup. It's delicious. Yeah. I like that. Now they don't have a lot of salt on it. It's mostly mm -hmm. sweet, but it's it's still very, very, very good. And it's nice popcorn. It's big popcorn. Yeah, it's the fatter popcorn where you don't get a lot of the holes in it, mm -hmm. these fat pieces. You get some, yeah. but not too many. Mm -hmm. Okay, and this is the Clancy's Crinkle Cut Braised Beef Short Ribs Kettle Chips Savory Slow Cooked Flavor Gluten Free. Um, I expect these to just have like a meaty spice. Yes. Uh, eight servings in the container, one ounce, 28 grams, about 12 chips, is 150 calories. I could tell this bag was gonna be easier to open. That Angie's has a thicker top to it, and I knew that I better just use scissors with that. These chips are tiny. These are very small. Yes, those are some small potatoes. It tastes exactly what I thought it would taste like. Delicious. It's very, very good. They're very meaty tasting with um, with kind of a sweet and savory seasoning. Mm. Those are really good. Those are awesome. I like the little burst of sweetness you get in it too. Just it, a little bit. It has, um, this is gonna sound negative, but it's not, I promise. It leaves a little bit of a greasy filling in your mouth like um like if you were to put a big old pat of butter on your meat and grill it huh? that's what it it has that greasy buttery i like it I know, and it's meaty yes. yeah it's very very meaty flavored when kevin's dad makes steaks he puts like half a stick of butter on each steak and that's what that <laughs> that's what that reminds me of it's really nice mm -hmm. very good I don't know if that says short ribs or whatever. It's yeah. just meat. Well, it's just meat. Yeah. It's just meaty. Um, now these are the Doritos Dynamita Flamin' Hot Queso. Yeah. 
here's time for our taste buds to be on fire. We looked for these everywhere. Everywhere, every store we would go in, and we go in a lot of stores, we would look for these. <clears throat> I had about given up looking for them, honestly. And I thought, well, if I find them, I find them, if I don't, I don't. So we went in Speedway, Kevin was getting gas, and I ran in, and lo and behold, on a little display, they had a bunch of like the 3D Doritos. These were down on the display. And I'm like, there those suckers are, I've been looking for them. Um, so this is uh, four servings in the bag, 15 pieces, it's 150 calories. So I'm just glad to find them, but I never have seen them around here in a big bag. So, of course, our chips are in here are kind of hard. Wow, those are scary. Well, they're flaming hot. They're full dynamite, flaming, yeah, flaming hot queso. And we love flaming hot. Oh, mm hmm. Yeah. You ate a whole one. You didn't eat a whole one? I know how hot flaming hot is. I don't want it. I don't want the flaming hot. Whew. Yeah, you do get the cheese at first, just a little bit, but then once the heat hits, you don't taste anything else. That's just hot. That's my only half. I didn't know. <laughs> Anytime it says flaming hot, just be careful. Um, hot. I just ate half and it's pretty hot. Yeah, it's pretty hot. It, it's, uh, it gets right in the, the back, uh, right on each side. Mm -hmm. um, I really wish they would, I know they like the flaming Hot, people love the flaming Hot, that's great. But for people that don't like the flaming Hot, I wish they had a really good flavored queso that wasn't flaming Hot. not flaming Hot. hot Maybe a little hotter, like spicy queso or something like that. I want, I want a little spice to it. Queso with want... jalapeno, yeah, but it doesn't, we've had queso with jalapeno, but it didn't like burn your lips off, you yeah. know? It, it wasn't that hot. And, uh, but it was still absolutely wonderful. So these, I love the shape. Yeah, the I like texture. They're easy to eat. They're very easy to eat. They're fun to eat because it's almost like eating those, uh, those potato straws, except these are thicker they're and, the, and the, they're crunchy. Yes. So they're really fun to eat, but I just, yeah, not flaming hot. Yeah. So yeah. if you I wish do, they had something between just regular queso cheese and flaming hot. I wish they had something in the middle. Yeah. If you do like flaming hot, though, of course you're, you, yeah, uh, you you're have to like try them. those. Yeah. But in a way, don't you think all these flaming hot things just. They end up all tasting the same. Yeah, they all have the same. So the texture's a little different, you know, because they have flaming hot Cheetos. And they're the, the, hot popcorn. a crunchy Cheeto is a different texture than the crunchy tortilla that's rolled. So in the end though, you're getting the same flavor, you're just getting um, a, a different uh, texture is what all you're doing is buying a different texture. Because yeah. all these flaming Hot things to me taste about the same. Yeah, of course, you know, they're very, very hot for us. So the queso is lost on us. Completely lost. Yeah, but that's the way it is in these flaming yeah, Hot things. That's what I'm saying. Eat. Maybe if you really are used to the hot food, you might you might get those things. distinct flavors, yeah, whereas <laughs> it's just hotter than heck. It's yeah. like, why? Why? Uh, but uh, so you only have these are completely different things. Um, Your calories don't I, matter. Which one I go for? Um, I really do like the short ribs. I'd probably go with the popcorn. But I like that popcorn. Yeah, because it's got a sweet. It's, it's, it's yes, it's sweet and it has that coating. When you yeah, look at the pieces, crisp. you can see that it like glistening with the the maple coating on the yeah, outside. It's really good. So yeah, I would get those over mm -hmm. and over again. Uh, these from Aldi though, they're oh, very they're good. Excellent. If you missed them uh, when they came out at Aldi, they'll have them back again. Just give them a little time and they'll be back out on the shelf again. So I hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.